Hello, and welcome to my guide for Rex's companion quest, Nothing But a Hound Dog. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get every single brain you can get for Rex, and I'm also going to, uh, to apologize, because previously I had promised a video on Vault 34. I do intend to make that video, it's just that, There's a man around here, uh, so last time when I recorded it, I fudged the audio, and halfway through the video there is just, there is no audio. Not my voice, not the game, nothing. And that really, really irks me, and I played for like an hour and a half afterwards, and there's no more saves, and it's just, it's just pain. It's just pain. Um, so yeah, we're gonna do, we're gonna do Rex's companion quest as a small makeup video. And I'm also gonna mention this right now. Uh, I've muted the in-game music and radio, because I know some of the radio songs are copyrighted, and I do not want to get a copyright strike. Just gonna say that right now. So... In order to do this quest, we have to have completed the quest GI Blues uh, for the kings. And we have to have not murdered the king, either, because that is a thing you can do. Things have been a lot better since you helped with those soldier boys. Thanks again. So, what can I do for you? That intro dialogue you can only get is... is, is you can only get that after you beat uh, GI Blues, but yeah. You have to ask him about Rex. What about him? And you have to say, is there something wrong with him? He's been acting peculiar for some time now. I took him to the followers and had him checked out, and they said his brain is bad or something. No, they said they don't have the tools to help him. And we have to offer our services, of course. I don't know. Maybe. If you found a way to help my poor Rex here, I'd be much obliged. Your best bet will be to talk to Julie Farkas over at the old Mormon fort north of here. Maybe you'll have better luck than I did. Yeah. All right. I'm just going to really quick switch my quest so I can see my quest markers, because I have the wrong quest mark currently. But yeah. Uh, so the first thing we need to do kind of involves a lot of wandering. And this is why I love the Freeside Open mod. Because it takes out the stupid fucking loading gate that was right here. The only problem with Freeside Open is that it adds so many fucking NPCs that Freeside becomes ridiculously unstable. Personally, if I was the mod out there behind it, I actually would have... Shut your whore mouth. I would have cut down on the size of Freeside to make it more manageable. But, whatever. I find that even with Freeside Open and all the instability issues associated with it, Freeside is still more stable with Freeside Open than it is without it. It is far more stable with Freeside Open. Like, seriously. I sincerely hope the NCR are getting supplies in place to defend against an attack, because it looks like the Legion has plans for the dam again. Mm, yeah. Just follow the quest-related dialogue. Rex? It breaks my heart every time I see him. He's such a good dog. Yes, a few months ago. We had to tell him there was nothing we could do. No, Rex's condition is way beyond anything we can handle. He requires brain surgery and some sophisticated cybernetics work, too. I didn't say that. While no one here has that kind of expertise, I do know of one man who might fit the bill. There's an old scientist named Dr. Henry who reportedly specializes in this sort of procedure. He'd probably be your best bet. Last I heard, he was living up in Jacobstown, far to the northwest. No problem. So I should mention that if you want to get Rex as a companion, you have to complete this quest. If you don't, after like an in-game week, you will die. Fuck me running, I don't have Jacobstown. Okay, we'll fix that in a moment. Uh, but yeah, if you, don't, if you don't do this quest, after about an in-game week or so, uh, Rex will, will just keel over and die. And we don't want that. We want him to live. Uh, he will keel over and die even if you're not playing on We've hardcore mode. That, that's a misconception I've seen about this people. quest a lot, is oh, that yeah. he's immortal unless you're playing on hardcore mode, which is not the case. He will just drop dead. Um, but yeah, I'm going to show you how to get every single dog brain, so don't, you, you don't have to worry a little bit about that. But first we have to get Rex to follow us. Things have been a lot better since you... She said, what? Why didn't she just say so when I was there? Actually, come to think of it, I was pretty angry when I went down there. I vaguely recall something about upending a few tables, maybe knocking out one of her doctors. Oops. Only thing is, yeah, there's too much going on around here for me to make a trip like that. And I need all of my guys just to keep things settled here. You seem to be awfully interested in my boy Rex here, and you've done some good work for me already. I'll tell you what, you promised to get Rexy here to that doctor, and I'll lend him to you. What do you say? Absolutely. I can't thank you enough. 
Now, there's a few things you should know about old Rex here, if you're going to be traveling together. First, he hates rats. Can't stand the things. Giant rats, mole rats, doesn't matter. He catches a whiff of one, and he's off like a shot after him. He's normally pretty obedient, but you might have to chase him some if he goes after one of the little varmints. Second, he doesn't like hats, or the people wearing them. Don't ask. I have no idea why. Maybe because it rhymes with rats. That should be it, though. Other than the occasional bad spot when his brain starts hurting him, that is. But I'm hoping you will see to that. I wish you both luck. Take care of my Rex now, you hear? Rex, this is your new master. Protect her as you would me. This is some of my favorite dialogue in the game. So yeah, he gives us the search and mark perk. Um, I don't even remember what that perk... I think if... Yeah, it's when you aim. Yeah, see? You can see the whiskey... Um, the beer, sorry. It glows green when I aim. Because that's Rex's perk taking effect. He's marking all the chems. He's making them glow. Uh, which is actually really useful. If you want to find stuff. But yeah. Anyway. Um, so in order to do this quest, we need to go to Jacob's Town. I'm just going to try this really quickly. Because if this doesn't work, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to, I'll, I'll, I don't know what to do. Did it work? Fuck. Uh, let's try COC Jake. Jake. I'm fucking misspelling his name. That's my problem. Jacob's Town. There we go. Uh, so in case you're wondering, COC just lets you teleport to a cell if you know its name. And that's all I did. I just I just teleported to Jacob's Town using console commands so that we don't have to walk there. It did kind of put us in a weird spot, though. But whatever. We're close to the thing. Yeah, normally you just have to walk here. It is kind of a dangerous walk because there are, there are Cazadors in the way. But, um, well, I'll let you handle that. I just don't want. I just don't want to bore you guys by walking like 20 minutes across the fucking Mojave Desert and doing bugger all. Another human. One, One was enough. enough. Yeah, yeah. I forgot before. I'll take that because that's where the shit. Actually, it's not. Whatever. So we go talk to Doc Henry. I assume this is about something important. You're interrupting my research. It's neural degradation. Biomed gel can only preserve a living brain for so long, so you'll need to find a replacement. I haven't left Jacob's town in years, but there was one woman in Novak, Gibson. I remember her living with a pack of hounds. Aside from her, I know that the fiends and Caesar's legion fight alongside dogs. There could be viable specimens among them, if you can get to them. Um, I already have some of the brains, but I'll show you where to get them all. Yes, yeah. Because I already have one from the fiends, I think. I'll show you how to get them all, starting with the fiends and the legion dog. Yeah, it's not gonna work in my mouth. Anyway, um, so in order to get the fiend dog brain, we need to go after Violet. The um, she's part of the quest three card bounty. She's fairly easy to deal with. Don't worry about her too much. Her dogs are also pretty easy to deal with. They're right by the Poseidon gas station, which you just saw me fast travel to. Um, yep, here they are. And yeah, normally the dogs. Normally her dogs attack from over here. Among them you will find one named Violet. I know that there's a I know that there's a leader named Violet. So the point is one of these dogs will be named Violet. She will attack from the trailer park area. You kill her, you loot her, and you get Violet's brain. Okay? I hope that was a simple enough exit. Again, they come from here, kill the dog named Violet, loot its corpse, take its brain. Super. Um Um, Old Lady Gibson is the next brain, and in my opinion, the brain she gives us is the most useful. It's the best. It gives us the best perk. However, it also costs, I think, 500 bottle caps, or a speech or barter check. And I'm not entirely sure, but I think you can use your Novak reputation to barter with her. And yes, I am actually going to walk to her, because I don't actually remember what her junkyard is called. I think it's called, like, Gibson Scrapyard or something. I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm not going to bother trying to... To, to COC over there because it's just like a stone's throw away from Novak. If you if you can't handle this much walking, I've I've got some bad news for you. Your, your legs have atrophied. Um, but yeah, the, the next brain comes from the Legion. We can only get it if we're pro Legion. I'm pro Legion as fuck on this character. That's why I'm doing it on this character because I can get all the brains on this character. And again, I'm going to apologize for not doing the video on Vault 34 as soon as I had hoped. It'll probably be like a couple of... It'll probably be a while but until I get bored of this character at the very least. So we talked to old lady Gibson. She climbs out of bed. Hi there. 
And yeah, we just told Doc Henry sent us. Dr. Henry? Now there's a name I haven't heard in years. Hard to believe he's still alive. As for your request, it's uh, a bit ghoulish if you ask me, but Ray is pretty old and I'll probably have to put him down soon enough. As for the price for this favor, 700 caps sounds about right. Ray's like family, and I've got other dogs to take care of. So if we have 70 barter, we can we can do that. I have a fucking shitload of caps, so I'm like rolling in it. Here, Ray. Mama's got something for you. I wish she doesn't like she doesn't like protest or anything. And also, she just fucking shattered his head. I, I, I like to imagine, because cause you don't hear a gunshot. That's the thing. I was expecting to hear a gunshot from a gun, but nah. Nah, she just, she just picks him up and, like, splits his head open with her fingers or something. Anyway, now we're off to the fort to get the final dog brain, which comes from... I cannot remember the name of this dog, and that's going to drive me crazy. Um, in order to get this one, we have to beat her to death with a knife. By order of Ka Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stick these up your butt. Right. We all know. True to Kaisar. Um, Kaisar awaits. Yes, yeah, yeah. Um. Ah, uh, right, right, right. So we have to beat the dog in the arena. We have to give her a quote unquote honorable death. Uh, AKA chop her to pieces with a machete, violently. This shouldn't be too hard, unless you're like an extremely non combat character. But again, even for you, it should. It's, it's one dog and you've got a big ass knife. Um. However, the one catch is that I'm not entirely sure if they'll let female characters do this, because I know that if you're female and the game is vanilla, completely unmodded, you cannot fight in the arena, which I think personally is stupid. Um, honestly, I wish the Legion didn't have that, but whatever. Where is he? He's somewhere over here. Yeah, he's over here. He's right over here. This, this dickhead. I'm sure you had to use a lot of healing powder on Kaisar. Well done. Anyway, um... Lupa. Yes, she's the mother of a lot of our best dogs. She's getting old, but she's still a tough old bitch. Aren't you, girl? Yeah. Cyberdog. Like the ones I've seen up in Denver? I know what you're talking about. And it would make Lupa immortal, in a way. You give Lupa a worthy death in the arena, and her brain is yours. Don't let your guard down just because she's old, though. Oh, and standard arena rules still apply. You don't get to wear armor, and you get only a machete for a weapon. All right. You've been a good dog, Lupa. Die well, girl. And my companion is coming here with me, okay? I was not expecting that. I was not expecting you to just roll up in here and bust Lupa. Okay, I'll take it. So yeah, we gained some Legion fame and nakedness. And I'm gonna put my pants on because I'm an embarrassed person. And now we can just fast travel up out of here while the universe gets added to my pocket. Um, if, if there might be another quest that might get triggered on our way here, uh, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it at all. Confiscated equipment has been returned to me on the way out of the fort. Welcome to Jacob's. Yeah, town. yeah, yeah. I'm just gonna skip your. I'm gonna skip your dialogue because. Well. Got a problem. Yeah, there we user. go. I'll see what I can do. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. The, 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 it's gonna. The game's gonna be adding out of here for a while. Holy hell! Is that a Nikon? See, this is one of the things that kind of bugs me about about the Fault in New Vegas modding community. This is like. Well, it's actually just—it's just a mod I want really badly. That I really think so much of Bake. Um, New Vegas Script Extender I know has a way for your items to be taken away from you, and then added back to your inventory without constantly saying X item was added, um, all at once without any triggering any sound effects. I don't know how it works because I'm not—I'm not a genius, but I still feel like there needs to be a mod like that for for the Legion taking my shit away. Anyway, so let's talk to Doctor Henry. Again, you interrupt me. Why? Because I found the shit. So, yeah. Very well. So, we have... We can tell him about all the brains. And he'll give us a little bit of... All right, let's see here. Neural pathways look good. Definitely a breed of guard dog. 
If I transplant this brain into Rex, he'll be a bit more ferocious in his attacks. So if we put Ray's brain into him, he gets more damage, and he, uh, if we get Lupus' brain... Let's take a look. Exceptional synapse responses. Descended from some type of cattle dog, I imagine. If you want me to transplant this brain into Rex, he'll become more durable. Yeah, so he gets better damage resistance. Um, if you put Lupus' brain into him, and Violetta moves, makes him move faster. Big brain on this one. All right, let's see. Damn. Heavy amounts of the chemicals used in the drug Turbo are present. Transplanting this brain will make Rex faster than he was before. So I'm gonna go with the with Lupus brain because Pro Legion and uh, I would recommend if you're playing on normal mode, put Ray's brain into Rex because it will make him do more damage. And if you're playing on hardcore, put Lupus brain into Rex. Have a seat. This will take a while. And, yeah, that's the quest, nothing but a hound dog. That's how you get all three brains. Who would have thought a place like this would exist? So, yeah. Again, I do apologize for the lack of a Vault 34 video. And I also apologize for the constant items being added to my inventory. I will make a Vault 34 video eventually. Just, I'm probably going to hold off on that until my next playthrough of New Vegas. Which, given the rate that this one is going at, that might be, like, sometime soon before the end of the month is what i'm hoping for but i i, I, I kind of doubt it i don't know we'll see we'll see where the winds take us i guess um thank you for watching if you haven't already please please do subscribe and also if you haven't already check out my other videos and even my steam guides because some of them have videos just like this and i i just i want to be popular okay